What's going on everybody? Poji Force here and welcome back to Borderlands 3. Last episode we finally took down Killavolt and finished a long string of side quests. So now we just need to go get the third piece of the vault key from Reese. But before we do, we're here on Sanctuary 3. Hey Maurice, hi buddy. How are you doing? Maurice smells blood hunger on you. Good. You will find Maurice's enemies and make them your own. This is DLC stuff. I'm I just wanted. hungry for blood. The only question is, whose is it this time? Maurice ah. has made enemies of powerful people. As part of his ongoing mission to learn the warm blood's ways, he joined a high stakes poker game. Uh, he apparently has a knack for it, but there was a misunderstanding. In Maurice's world, it is good manners Get well for the winner of a contest. Oh, to that is adorable! The organizers of the game were unfamiliar with this custom. Ah, so you ate somebody and someone else is out for revenge, huh? The leader of the Galactic Iridium Cartel now seeks vengeance. Already some of his lackeys have broken Maurice's arm and threatened worse. Oh, you that's why he's got a cast. Cartel leader's hideout and slay him. But it is well hidden. Maurice requires the coordinates in order to send you there. Begin with his informants. I'd so like to kill people I can't see, love, but uh, I'll need a little more to go on. Maurice last had an informant sent in Ascension Bluff. Perhaps they cower nearby. So, that's cool and all. I just wanted to talk to Maurice. I love this guy. He's adorable. He reminds me of Yoshi. And he's got hey, a cast that's extra fishing. adorable. But when you go pick up the third vault key piece from Reese. So we're going to do that instead. I may... Because that is a... Uh, a side mission. And it's a... Uh, you know what? Yeah, we'll go ahead. We'll go ahead and go do that. We'll do that. It's a level 13 side mission. We're level 21. Sure. Let's do that. Ascension Bluff. Where is that? All right. So we got to find this cartel agent who seems to be up there. So that shouldn't be too hard. Oh, wow. He lived. Lag! I definitely need a better graphics card. How does this game lag so badly? Dropped an informant, Maurice. They had some coordinates on them. Get good or die. I guess they were the informant. Looks like we got a satellite up here that we can turn off. So we should do that while we're here. The Calypsos live and breathe for attention. Taking away the mic is sure to get their skivvies in a twist. And not in a good way. Apparently there's a good way to get your skivvies in a twist. That's interesting to know. Dead Claptrap. Okay. Um, I'm not sure how else I'm search galaxy for hideout coordinates the entire galaxy Here I come Climbing down I don't know what that's about but there is a dead claptrap we're gonna go pick that up Where is this dead claptrap? Oh there he is Alright. I feel like this Revenge of the Cartels thing is a multi-parter. Let's go check in on Claptrap's friend, actually, because we've gotten a lot of Claptrap parts, so it'll be interesting to see how she's upgraded since the last time we saw her. Alright, how's she doing? How do your motive resonators feel? They're supposed to give you the human experience. I feel very sensitive to all stimuli! Happy! Wait! Losing hope! If my experience is anything to go by, you'll only feel like that all of the time. <laughs> you only feel like that all of the time. 
Anything else? It's hard not having anyone to look up to the way you look up to me. I guess that's just the cost of being perfect. I don't know if that How ego is a boon or a curse. I feel very sensitive to all stimuli. All right, so we're back on Promethea now, and we're going to go take care of meeting up with Reese. What is this? Ooh. <clears throat> I'm Shanice Kyrie, and this is your Morning Meridian. We're here this morning with Reese Strongfork, the CEO and re-founder of Atlas Corporation. Welcome, Reese! Great to be here, Shanice. Reese, in bringing Atlas back into the galactic market, you've done something many would have thought impossible only a decade ago. What's the secret to your success? Secret alien technology, Shanith. <laughs> I'm kidding. Atlas is thriving because we've taken it in a new direction. I believe a company should lift its employees on its shoulders, not the other way around. And what about your competition? Atlas has been attracting a lot of attention. Have you had any buyout offers? I'll be honest, we've gotten some pretty uh, aggressive offers from certain legacy weapons brands, but I'm not selling. Atlas is a standalone brand. It's gonna stay that way. As long as I'm alive. Ah, uh, why did I say that? You, you, you can cut that, right? Right? It's live? Ah, Jerry, why are you always scheduling these things? So I really appreciate the fact that he's actually supporting his employees. That makes them a good company in my book, even if they are still selling weapons of mass destruction. There we go, there's the way. Must have fallen down the stairs. Looks like he was testing an experimental stair climbing module. Oh, I see the problem. He didn't turn it on. What a dead idiot. That module might come in handy for my new friend. Might actually make her better than Claptrap. I wonder how he'd feel about that. This way will work. Up here. And then in here? No. Over this way. I am... No. Over this way. I'm totally not lost. I don't need a map. What is here? What happened to Leon? Can I play that again? Yes, I can, but I think I'm going to finish this fight first before I do that. Because I couldn't really hear what was going on. Oh! These enemies are all level 13. How did I end up so over level? Oh, that felt good. Blowing through ammunition like crazy, but that feels good. All right. That's a little odd. I think I'm definitely getting more shots per actual shotgun shell out of that. But now we can actually listen to what Typhon DeLeon has to say. I found the key just sitting there in front of the vault. Good thing I didn't open it myself. I gave the vault key to Atlas. Got a boatload of cash, and the rest is history. Anyway, as soon as I made my money, who shows up at my door but Aslan de Vega, saying I owe him half of the cut? Baloney! I was on my own. And after that, whenever somebody wanted to find Iridian ruins, they called me. Typhon de Leon, the first Vault Hunter. So he wasn't a real Vault Hunter, it was an accident. And then he didn't even open the vault himself. I feel like that's going to come back to haunt him later on in his life. You get a lot of ammo. And I have a feeling that the difficulty is going to spike. It's weird that I have a, everything that I'm using has less than 10 magazine size, or less than 11. 10 or less magazine size. 
and it's at the same time putting out a ton of damage. It's kind of oh, nuts. You're here. Awesome. Zero, let them in. Zero, they're here, buddy. Open up the door. Oh, great. Now Zero's missing. <laughs> I guess I'll buzz you in myself because the CEO has to do all the work around here. I hope Zero didn't turn on us. I'm going to be very disappointed. Flex Stalker skill tree lets you turn invisible while a monkey with a gun shoots your enemies. Need we say more? All right, we're here in Atlas HQ. And I hear gunshots in the distance. Come up to my office slash museum grade aquarium and I'll get you that tasty key fragment. Now I just have to find where Zero disappeared to. Easy, Liam. The Vault Hunter's with me. VIP. All access. Oh, sorry, sir. Wow, a real Vault Hunter. Right away, sir. Selling off some of this junk. We fill on ammo. That Lorelei is an inspiration. Bloody, brutal, and she taught me some sweet new curse words. Ya wanka, classic. So she's British. <laughs> Let's see what's going on Welcome here. To Atlas. We built this place from the foundations. The old Atlas was just a pile of glass sand and bankruptcy filings when I got here. Nice place, Reese. I'm gonna enjoy watching it burn from the inside out. Get over it, Katagawa! You can't hold the city. The key fragments slipped through your fingers, and now you're losing your grasp on reality! That's three hand things right there! Yay, you can't get past my defense turrets! <laughs> Your friend Zero can. Don't tell me Zero turned on us. I don't, don't make me mad at you, Zero. What the hell? That was the defense command center. Oh no. Reach! All troops to the courtyard. Where the hell is Zero? I'm be very mad. Think, guys are still only level 13. This is child's play. Okay, these guys are level 17. Let's tuck a few grenades out there for good measure. I am moving fast. I'm a speedy bean. If Zero turned on us, I swear to God. I hope his faith in Zero is not misplaced. Reese, it looks like Zero killed everyone. No, 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 no. Zero's loyalty is not in question. Wherever he is, he must have a good reason. You just focus on kicking out Malawan. I'm gonna be very upset. And I can already tell Reese is not happy. Oh, looks like I got a new skin. Can't hold out much longer. Eat it, Kanagawa! Eat that tasty Atlas tech! <laughs> ah, yeah! Courtyard defenses are back online! Ooh, if we can get the rear defenses up too, we might actually survive this! Head through Atlas Tower. My troops are still holding. Yeah, I could use the practice. Let's do this! Things are getting toasty! I wonder if Zero turns out to be a robot and he's been hacked. 
get into Atlas Tower. Soldier, don't you dare use your last words to slander Zero. Say you're being murdered by someone else. I'm not happy with this with this change of events. This turn of events. Not happy with it at all. I love the the quality of the hip fire that I'm getting out of this. Dead claptrap. I don't know if that has any relation. Typhon de Leon! Atlas, they lied to me! Bastards, Reese! I don't even want Atlas anymore. Your brand is over. I'll make more profit selling your employees' organs than your guns. Tim Yukatagawa! My brand! My brand! Atlas, anyway. they lied to me! Bastards said that they were gonna use the Vault Tech to make Promethea Paradise! But all they did was quadruple their standing army and added a new feather in their cap, the Crimson Lance. Those bastards bled the people dry and worked them to the bone. After a while, I said to myself, screw Atlas. I gotta get out of here. Yeah, but this is a different Atlas. <laughs> Mecca! That's one down. No. Bad dog. So we gotta take out a few more enemies. And I really hope Zero has a good explanation for his behavior. I'm gonna be very upset if it turned out that Zero's gone bad guy. Oh no. The turrets are gone. Reese, we're running out of options. Oh crap. Uh, okay. Well, we left the Viper driving the orbital laser, right? Um, maybe it's got enough juice left to take out that command ship. <laughs> you gotta hold them up while I get it working. I got a turret! Chocolate dill pickle, really? This might actually work. Uh, 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 laser control, got it. Spinning up the asteroids reactors. We are only gonna get one shot. Oh, Skywell. Who's gonna use Skywell? Take down that Arbalest. Or Hoplot, whatever they want to call it. I can't get a target lock. Fire the damn thing! I got it! I got it! Oh, that was nice. It's beautiful! It's so beautiful! Oh, wow. I am legitimately crying! Oh, thank you. Thank you, Vault Hunter. Atlas is, is safe. Now I just 
I need to go. Tell me where to go. Take the elevator to Reese's office. You just don't get it, do you, Reese? This whole war could have been nice and quick. I move in, take Promethea, and make Atlas a subsidiary of Malawan. Then I make you vice president of Beach Drinks. We all win. That's how it works. That's how it's always worked. You were special, Reese. I saw that. You brought this bottom shelf company back from the dead. With you and the family, we could have turned Malawan into a universal monopoly. You and me, brothers, selling the only weapons anyone would ever need in all six galaxies. But I reached out my hand. Now you're not family. Just a competition. Please don't be dead. Please don't be dead. Please don't be dead. Please don't be dead. This really is a fancy office. not the real zero you should have joined the family Reese it was Katagawa pretending to be zero now where's the real one sniping I am so happy to see that that is not in fact zero instead he was playing off of people's trust of zero okay that's not the real one oh. no bonus. Ooh. he doesn't have that much health You're a coward, Katagawa. The passive health regeneration is going to ensure. Where is he? He's in here somewhere. Not our good guy. Hold still! I need to run and hide for a second. Give me some health. There we go. I'm in good shape. That wasn't the real one. That must be the real one. I've almost got him. Time for a fight. Ooh. Does he really still have health left? Where do you think you're going, Katagal? Yeah, that's the end of Katagawa. He deserved that.
I am so happy that well Zero did not turn on us. Thank you for saving my bro. That creep is finished. Zero, where the hell were you? I was on the hunt. Could not give myself away. Radio silence. Like I said, Zero, I super trusted you the whole time. And it was completely justified. As for you, Vault Hunter, I owe you everything. You fought off an all-out corporate assault, saved my company, and killed my creepy business stalker. But before I give you this key fragment, I have one last thing to ask of you. Am I pulling off this mustache or what? Choose to keep the stash or choose to lose the stash. Here's the thing, Reese. I loved you without it. It looks okay on you, but you know what? You look better without it. Trust me on that. You look better without it. It's the worst thing that ever happened to me and anyone else who has to look at you. Wow. Okay, that's uh. That's Lose the mustache, Reese. Mm. Thank you, Vault Hunter. I will remember that. Reese will remember that. Go. One vault key fragment, as promised. Zenara destroyed. Oh. No more parties. Just cold space. Dust in orbit. Somehow you do not look like yourself, Reese. I'm not sure what the deal is. On fire. But very good. That is the third and final vault mm. key fragment. Bring it to me on sanctuary and I will assemble the full key. Okay. Well then, he has a side quest for us. How did he copy my suit? Did she? No. Never. Interesting. She, someone designed Zero Suit. All right, I get a new point. Um, and we're gonna go one more into personal space. And Reese has a new hey, quest for us. It's you ready to answer the call to adventure? Hey, can you uh, track something down for me? Ah, this place is a mess. Ever since the attack, I've been seeing Ratch all over Atlas. My janitor, Terry, is supposed to be taking care of it, but no one's seen him. Go find Terry and get him back to work. Check his office first. Lorelei scares me, but, you know, in a good way. Am I making sense? Yeah, I think so. You're making sense. Let's do the Ratched Up. Where is Terry? There's a door on this side as well. And one of those symbols. Strange markings. Hmm. Where is Terry? All the way at the bottom. Okay. Oh wow. That is a lot of sticky deposit boxes. Oh, I only got to open two. Oh, certain ones are open and then certain ones are locked interesting I wonder if there's a way to get them all unlocked all right Terry's office is right here there's a lot of boxes all right Terry's office should be right here maintenance oh boy Terry really lives like an animal uh, look around. Maybe he left like a day planner or something. Not that he really seems like a day planner kind of guy. There's gotta be a clue in there somewhere. Maybe look behind stuff? I know I always hide clues to my location behind random stuff. It's a... A secret door? Terry's a janitor. What secrets does he need to keep? Ah, oh, don't, don't answer that. Every possible answer is gross. Oh, that's one of the old skunk works labs. Yeah, I shut it down after all the accidents. I said that all spooky, but it was just a lot of paper cuts. Prometheus healthcare system is a nightmare. It was just cheaper to shut down the lab. I'm I'm nervous about paper cuts now. Keep looking around while I go find my little rubber finger guards. Oh no. I gotta save my friend, he's sick. I know I'm just a janitor, but I gotta do something. I saw an ad on the Econet for online courses in advanced surgery and neuroscience. 100% guaranteed degree at 10% the price. That could work. I mean, you can't put something on the Echo Net if it's not true, right? 
Uh, I am not looking forward to finding Terry. Oh. Is that Terry? I don't think it is. But I'm not sure. Is it safe yet? I can hear you out there. Hello? Who's in there? You are Terry? Where is he? What have you done to Terry? He's supposed to let me out when it's safe. Did this Terry guy kidnap you? What? No, 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 no. He locked me in here to keep me safe from the others. He was gonna let me out once the coast was clear, but it's been a while. Man, I hope he's okay. Could you get me out of here? The door controls are on the other side of that glass. Yeah, right there. That's the door control. Over there, huh? Well, I can't open that door, so I gotta go around this way. Out, chuck a bunch of quasars. Oh, what? Find Terry, open Glen Cell, eliminate the Ratch threat. But I feel like that's Terry in the cage there. There's definitely some kind of secret up there. Just gonna need to figure out how to get up there. And the one enemy seems to have glitched, which is most unfortunate. I think this I think this glitched. Oh there it is. Oh no, that's gotta be Terry. Dude, what happened to you? Oh man, it feels so good to be out of there. Come say hi. He's a wretch though. Um Uh you're a wretch. Yep, thanks to my main man Terry, he saved my life. Come on, we got to find him. Um Ah no! Terry! They got him! Was that supposed to be Terry? Right, tell me what's going on right now or I'm just going to start punching. Terry was my best bud. When my human body got sick, he vowed to save me. He took some Echonet courses and found this lab, and pretty soon he figured out how to transfer human brains to rat bodies. All these other ratches here are escape failed experiments. Terry had to test the brain transfer process before he tried it on me, so he used bandits and captured Malawan soldiers. That's Quick, kind of barbaric. The only chance to save Terry is to get his brain into a ratch body. I'll chew it out. No, 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 you don't have to. Oh, oh, yep, it's happening. Now grab his brain so we can bring him back to life. Great, the brain transfer tank is downstairs. Ah, but Gary's cage is in the way. Hey, Gary! Uh, I'm gonna eat your face! Uh, I'll wear your mom skin as kimono! Uh, uh, I'll feed your kids to you! Uh. <laughs> Classic Gary. Malawan war criminal. Honestly, I think he ate people before he got ratched up. Flip that switch to drop his cage so we can get to the transfer tank. Ratched up. I think that's just gonna let him out. I'm gonna have to fight him. Hurry! I'll guzzle your soul milk! I'll break your toenails! Gary got out. I'm gonna stay up here and maybe you go kill him and do the brain transfer thing. Oh, Thor, that's what did you in. 
So these rats were human. Hey, Gary. Bye, Gary. Oh, mm, that's not what I was supposed to do. Wrong direction. All right, there's already a fresh rash body in there. I don't know how Terry gets the rash brain out, but I did see him sharpening an ice cream scoop the other day. Uh, okay, I'm just going to mash on this keyboard and hope the whole brain transfer thing works out automatically. Better than this, huh? You're not just a rat. You're Terry, and you are alive. Ah, uh, 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 Glenn, I'm alive, and I'm a rat. You brought me back. I'm alive. Terry, we did it, buddy. We survived. Um. Hey, rescuer, I got a thank you present for you. Okay, so I finally found the little rubber thing that goes in your thumb, and you are not gonna believe where- Whoa! Whoa, talking rat. I am not caught up on this. Actually, you know what? Don't tell me. Plausible deniability. I'm just going to do some CEO stuff and look the other way. We found that cool Atlas weapon prototype when we moved into the lab. But it only works with, you know, hands and stuff. So enjoy! Okay. Um, I want to grab this first. I feel like this is the part two. All right, day 32 of neurotransfer trials. Had a lot of misfires, but that's how you improve, right? Containment on the invalid specimens has proven tricky, but that's the great thing about abandoned labs. There's always cages. As long as we don't lose power, they'll stay put. But this is a corporate headquarters. No way are we losing power. No way are we losing power. And then they lost power. Fucking, you did it! You brought me back! Hell yeah, man! I wasn't gonna leave you dead on the floor! Oh, right. I kinda ate your body, man. Sorry. No, no, I totally get it. I could actually super go for a human body right now. Ratch pals for life, man! Ratch pals for life! Um... Hey, what's up? Okay. Look around, Chief. You've got a right to protect yourself. Peacemonger. 40 damage per bullet. 12 magazine size. Inferior to absolutely everything I already have. And I just realized I'm back to an all legendary loadout. So. I want to do one last thing today. Now, there we go. Shoot. I need to do a lot of science, and your natural odor is alluringly potent and thus distracting. Weird. Crimson Raiders to the bridge. You did it, killer. It'll be a long time before Malawan forgets the thrashing you gave him. Let's see the Calypsos try to spin that. Now, we've got an opening, and we're going to take it. Reese, where's that vault? First off, I want to say a little something. You saved my skin and the skins of every Atlas employee. And skin's important. Stop saying skin. Right. The vault. It's hidden underneath the Apollyon Transit Station. It's in the middle of the city? How did no one ever find it? The old Atlas Corporation just paved right over it. I found it when I took over, but I wasn't about to pop the top on that thing in a populated area. Opening a vault is messy stuff. But I'll leave that up to you. Reese. Oh! have to be fast. We go in through the skyway by vehicle. 
Got it. I'll take point with the Vault Hunter. This one's mine. We're opening a vault, Maya. You expect me to miss that? I can handle myself, Siren or not. Lilith, we don't know what's down there. It could get ugly. You brought me back to the Raiders for a reason. You're the commander. Use the weapons you've got. Okay. This one's all you. Next vault, we do it together. Once you've got your wings back. Yeah. All right, Maya. Let's gear up. First of all, what should I bring? Nope. Stay with Lilith. Seriously? What have I been training for? I'm ready, Maya. Not yet. Not yet. This See feels like a multi-chapter story. Ava, I can use some help up here on the bridge. You want to take calm? Yeah, no, I'm good. Also, I thought Tiny Tina was supposed to be part of this game. I have not seen her. There is more to this. But that's going to have to wait till next time. We are got all three pieces of the vault key. We're about to assault our first vault. I have a feeling there's multiple vaults. Because there's a lot of characters that I have not seen yet. Tiny Tina's supposed to be here somewhere. But that's all for now. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please hit that like button. And subscribe to stay tuned for future videos. Also, don't forget to hit that bell icon if you want to be notified of when I upload. And I also have Facebook and Twitter as well. So don't forget to check that out. We can't stop now. There's too much to do. So all the self-promoting bullshit out the way. Thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time, everyone, I am Poji Force, And you all take care. Catch you later. Strange times.